Hey, hey, welcome back. Before I get into this video, where I'm going to show you this code that will show you the Fibonacci sequence. It prints it out to like 100 billion trillion. Uh, I want to just briefly go over what the Fibonacci sequence is for anybody who's not, you know, aware of it. Um, but I would encourage you to do further research outside of this video. So the golden ratio of the Fibonacci sequence is this uh, crazy mathematical formula or realization, epiphany basically. And all throughout nature this sequence can be found in, in various forms of life and the geometric construct that their DNA has enabled them to become. So it's this crazy phenomena that it, it, it can be the golden ratio or the Fibonacci sequence can be observed in hurricanes, continents, galaxies, plants, most predominantly in plants, but it's found everywhere. It's even been linked to um, when when you see someone of the opposite of sex and you find them attractive, there's actually the Fibonacci sequence behind that that's been scientifically verified. So the it's also called the golden ratio, and the Fibonacci sequence is identified by the pattern of which every number after the first two equals the sum of the two preceding ones. So, 1 plus 1 equals 2, 2 plus 1 equals 3, 3 plus 2 equals 5, 5 plus 3 equals 8, 8 plus 5 equals 13, 13 plus 8 equals 21, and so on. The, fin the Fibonacci spiral is what I was talking about when I was talking about hurricanes and galaxies. It's an approximation of the golden spiral created by drawing circular arcs connecting the opposite corners of squares in the Fibonacci tiling. And here's an example of the Fibonacci spiral. And as you know, this might just sound kind of crazy, and but I saw this on this documentary. The if you look at the curve on the left, that's actually the curvature of a female bottom. And that's what I was talking about when I was talking about the uh, Fibonacci sequence that's found everywhere in human beings too. So here's the Fibonacci spiral again also goes for the shape of, let's say, a seashell. Here it is again. And here's an example of it in nature. And there's many more of these. Feel free to go on Google and use their imaging. So let's look at the code. And then uh, it's basically just a mathematical formula in Pythonic expression that allows us to display all the Fibonacci numbers from 1 to this number right here, which I don't even know what that number is. It's an astounding number, but we know it's way beyond a million and a billion and a trillion. But this but one of the you know, this computer can do it in a matter of seconds. Or not even not seconds, like fractions of a second. So the code is real straightforward. Define a main function A what this basically says is, well, never mind what this down here basically says is, is that A equals B and B equals A plus B, basically what it represents. So when we run this, it just echoes out the Fibonacci numbers all the way to that big gigantoid number that I made. So until next time, I'm Scott, everything awesome. I hope you found this kind of cool. You know, I'm not a mathematician, but I think it's fun and interesting. So and then I also want to encourage you to look more into the golden ratio, and I'm going to make another video on that or add to this one and turn it into one big long video. But it's pretty cool, and you'd be amazed what you can find out about it. Until next time, I'm Scott, everything awesome. Peace out.